We stopped a hundred clicks from Moscow to check our Geiger counters. The thing is, they are all in the green, as if they're in a conspiracy. Still, this amazing piece of news doesn't really impress anyone that much. The guys are all confused as to what to do next. And I... I'm just waiting for answers. And hoping the commander, whom until recently I trusted implicitly, is going to be extremely persuasive in his reasoning. so to speak, where everybody can help but wonder, what next? Where do we go from here? Hmm, yes. More or less what I expected from you. But you got the picture. So, is your counter functioning? Have you checked it? Yes, it's all green. Double checked it. Stepan's in the green too. We don't need masks here. So, they were telling the truth. Who was telling the truth? Why won't you answer? Who were those people trying to kill us? Why would they shoot at you, the Order's commander? Explain something, at least! You owe us that! Well, I might as well drop the bomb now. The war did not end. What do you well, mean, uh, did not end? Let me finish. Most of our cities are destroyed. The rest of the country is probably under enemy occupation. To avoid new nuclear attacks against us, Command chose the only viable course of action, to play dead. To ensure radio silence, the SHIELD system was created. A network of radio jammers covering Moscow and suburbs. So that some radio enthusiasts wouldn't bring more bombs down on our heads by whining on air. And it's one of these jammers that got disabled by the hands of those present here. Could you not have shared that before? Say, uh, before Artyom took that radio outside and caught all that radiation? No! I only got briefed half a year ago. Oh, that explains it then. Street, you talk, you die policy. And then had to tell my people we were securing a weather station. Sir, with all due respect, if we can't go back, maybe we should advance and move on? I have an idea, but... Uh, Artyom, rather than carrying on with this silent disapproval of yours, <laughs> check the airwaves. We should be out of the jamming range by now, so give it your best try. Look for transmissions from the Ark. <sighs> Do you understand now why we are traitors in the eyes of command? We shut down a jamming station, shot up the guards, destroyed a patrol train, and ran away from Moscow. Who even needs a trial when the case is so clear? There's no way back now. Which means we have to continue moving forward. Command, what are you talking about? The Moscow Defense Command. Have you ever heard of the Invisible Watchers? I have, but they're just an urban legend. Not at all. They are command. Are you sure they care for more than just protecting their asses? You mentioned the Ark. What's that all about? If Artyom finds their signal, you'll figure everything out. Otherwise, there is nothing to talk about. Do you think finding that Ark of yours is going to fix everything? I do not. But if you have a better idea, then go ahead. Yes, I do. We have to find a good place for people from Moscow. Like Artyom always wanted. Giving them all to the enemy? A grand idea. I say, we solve our problems before moving on to saving all Moscow. All right? How is it going, Artyom? Found it yet? Nah, no, I was listening. There's a whole world out here. A world where we could live. So far, we only know one thing for sure. Radiation levels are nominal. The air is breathable. But what about the rain? So what? You can't even breathe in Moscow. So? Does anybody live out here? We don't know. How will they treat us? I don't know that either. What would they do if they found out there are survivors in Moscow? Again, I don't know. 
Keep looking, Artyom. That's got to be a signal. But we do know we've been lied to. For 20 years, we've been lied to. We know they've been killing people. Collateral damage is inevitable in operations of such scale and secrecy. Yes, people have died. But the bombs killed tens of millions. Yet we are alive. We stayed alive throughout those years. Artyom almost got killed. Is he just collateral damage too? Guess what? Yes! If you have to choose between the life of a single man, no matter how dear he is to you, and the lives of everybody else, all the dwellers of Metro, then there's nothing to think about. Are you looking for it, Artyom? Come on, do your best! Would you say the same about me? And about myself, too. I've spent my whole life protecting the people of Metro. Do you get it? My whole life. And I wouldn't hesitate for a second. I'm prepared to do anything to ensure Metro survives. Even though they'd shoot me on sight if I returned now, it doesn't matter. Too many lives are at stake. Too many lives have already been sacrificed to hesitate now. Too many. I'm sorry. I didn't want to... I mean... But we have to make up our minds. How will things finish for all of us if we start out lying to each other and arguing? We need to be better. You ask me how things will finish. Well, let me tell you. It all depends on Artyom now. If he finds the frequency, if they are alive... <sighs> Found it yet, Artyom? Please, try! It must be there! Oh, finally, they're done talking. Um, as much as I hate Miller, um, yet, at this Artyom. part of the story, he kind of makes sense. Got to be there. Look some more! Are you looking for it, Artyom? Come on! Do your best! <sighs> Found it yet, Artyom? Please, try! It must be there! <sighs> Nothing yet, Artyom! <sighs> this signal has got to be there! Look some more! Keep looking at him! That's got to be a signal! Is it moving? It seems to be moving though. Like it's changing pos it's changing frequencies. I guess I was really close there. I should have done this while they were talking. I didn't know it would be it would take this long. Got to be a signal. Proceed to the rally point. Rally point location is code one eight one one dash. Wait a moment. What was that? Area one eight dash five. I repeat. Listen, everyone. Rally point location is code one eight one one dash seven nine. Area one eight dash. Five. Only by standing together Where was that number supposed to Got it! So, it is somewhere around here. The Yamantal Mountain. So, the route from here should go... Uh, like this. This is our goal! So, is this what you had in mind? Yes! This is it! The Ark Project is a whole city underground. Enormous stores, machines, the best experts. It is the Commander General's HQ. All of the country's leaders are there. They have already started the restoration work. We will tell them that Moscow is alive. It wasn't all for nothing. 
Everything will change, everything! Do you get it? A new life is starting for all the survivors of the <laughs> world! Yeah. Oh, by the way, are there any single women in that place? <laughs> Great reaction. So I think the moment calls for... <clears throat> Bring it out to me. Bring what out, Colonel? Sir? That thing that's been sloshing about in your canteen. <laughs> you think I'm deaf or what? Ah, uh, that. Uh, just a moment. I, I thought my ears were deceiving me. <laughs> 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 it's not a short trip to the Urals, so we should make ourselves comfortable, I guess. Well, let's name this bucket of bolts at the very least, eh? It's about time. Let's go around and be done with you. <laughs> nah, go to hell. <laughs> Even better. Oh, come How on. How about Aurora, the Roman goddess of dawn and a cruiser of, uh, uh, you know what? That's better. <laughs> Not bad. I like it. Ah, beautiful name. Sounds okay, but the cruiser of what? Yeah. I'll tell you later. Looks like it's decided. <laughs> Let's trick you to the world! Hey, Artyom, let's take a look at that map. All right, we had a round. That should be enough. You're back. Full steam ahead. Hi. Full oh, steam yeah. ahead. Wow, that's on distance. I wonder how long it will take. Wait, so you can resume the journey or continue exploring the train. Wait, what's going? I don't really understand. Um, I'm just looking at the map now. Is that where we were on the upper left? The first circle is at us, and then we we're going to the second circle to the top right. Okay, so that's the only thing I can do here. B. Oh, what's up? Uh, what? Uh. After all those oh. years in the underground, the air of the surface seemed incredibly fresh, intoxicating. But that was not what had caused the crew's euphoria. Our journey finally got a definite purpose provided by the transmission from the government bunker in the Urals. For 20 years, we thought that neither the government nor military high command had survived. Turns out they're still around. Where were they while we were eating each other alive in the metro? We'll have a lot of questions for them once we reach Yamantau. If we reach it. The ruins of our country are under enemy control, according to Miller. And we'll have to fight through to our goal. A small team against the occupation armies? What are the chances that we'll succeed? That we'll get some answers? Yeah, I'm not gonna play this level yet, but uh, I was just thinking earlier uh, about everything that Miller said. Uh, but he was just briefed like a half a year ago about this quote unquote command. And I'm having the same questions here that Artyom has. Um, where were they while we were eating each other alive in the metro? If there seems to be like a higher command a higher power over metro or overlook metro where were they where when there were wars between the reds the nazis what were they doing when the stations are having problems against the dark ones all of a sudden they they popped up and there's this problem with them with them having with them always needing to play dead ever since the the bombs drop 20 years ago it seems like my confusions while they were talking earlier are the same with Artyom's questions you know i don't know i don't know if this is a good thing or a bad thing if i really place myself on Artyom's shoes when i was playing the first two games because the same confusion that the same confusions that i have he also has it and i think I think this is a good thing. We're gonna we're gonna get the answers together, me and the character, as well as you viewers who haven't played the game yet. So yeah, I think that's it for this one, and I'm gonna play this level next episode. I think. Too bad I missed the other conversations on the train. 
because I didn't know that this, this was gonna happen. But yeah, I'm gonna play this level on the next episode. Thank you guys for watching, even though this is a short one. Um, like if you like the video, just like if you didn't like it, <laughs> because it was too much conversation. I'll understand. Uh, and yeah, maybe subscribe. Yeah, thank you guys for watching, and see you on the next one.